I think, um, so this is just an example of not only do all those gender and sexual identities have their own flag. So these flags, it includes two spirit, autosexual, scoliosexual, demisexual, polysexual. And I'm just, just showing you this, this is, this is from a girls' school, and I'm just adding this to show you the position of cisgender in this. Cisgender doesn't have its flag, but where, this is, this is St. Paul's Girls' School. If you're cisgender, you get shades of gray. Not, not, not 50 shades of gray, I think that's a, <laughs> I think that's under the trans umbrella actually. Um, so, it, and it describes gender as uh, uh, the state of being male or female with regards to social constructs. Um, and cisgender is someone, and this lays it out really clearly what's it, what we know cisgender means, someone who identifies with the gender they were assigned at birth. So the social constructs of that gender, in other words, stereotypes. So the cisgender girl is a stereotypical girl who agrees with all the social constructs of being female. And many, many girls don't. And I, I think very few would agree with all of, the, all of the social stereotypes of what it is to be female. 